Hey guys, um, today's Friday the 7th and I am heading to the new Walgreens. Apparently we haven't, the um, Walgreens on the west side of town opened and so I'm going to go check it out. But before I do that I'm going to stop at Montessori where Bruno is and hopefully the dogs are outside playing because I want to watch him when he doesn't know I'm there because if Mike and I are there he just he's only interested in us and so yeah so I'm gonna go stop at Montessori and just park and see if I can see him and then I'm gonna go to Walgreens and then I have to go get some groceries and something for making craft pens that the frugal crafter, she did a video, she's trying to make her own Wink of Stella pens, and so I wanna get, I need to get some microfine glitter and some of the water brush pen type things, and I need to get either pledge or future floor wax, and then you mix them together and you get, a Wink of Stella like pen. So I probably will stop at Joanne's for that. And the bottom of this hill gets really slippery. I don't know if you can see. And I washed my car yesterday. Went through the car wash. Yippee! It was dirty. Because we had some wet snows and yeah. No, Denali's not out. Denali's covered by mountains or by clouds. Sometimes on a clear day, you can see Denali just past those lights. I mean, it's you know like 150 miles away, but okay. Well, I will see you at Montessori. Bye. Well, I went by Montessori and the dogs were not outside, so I didn't do any recording and didn't stop. So now we are on our way to the new Walgreens, which a friend of mine uh, told me is open. So I'm going to go see what they have, see if they have any deals on makeup, you know, because I need some more, some more makeup because I'm just running out. There's Sophie's Station. So over here is the Fred Meyer. You've heard me talk about Fred Meyer. This is not the one I usually come to. We live on the east side. This is the west side. And it's cold out. See? That's how we dress all winter. Carl's Jr. I love Carl's Jr.'s low carb $6 burger wrapped in lettuce. They're delish. Angus burgers. Here's Safeway. A lot of times I don't even come over to this side of town. Oh, behind Carl's Jr. over there in the Teddy Bear Plaza. Yes, that's what it's called. Teddy Bear Plaza it is Taylor's Golden Stones. And um, that's a really nice jewelry store. Great people. Um, and over there, that's where Cosmoprof is in Teddy Bear Plaza. So... Alaska girls kick ass. Can you see that? Yep. What is the temperature? Oh, it's 7. It's not too bad. I think it's supposed to get up to like 10 today. So, not too bad. And then we're supposed to have a warm up. Although, who knows what the hell that means. Oh, I don't know if the sun, the sun just flashed me in the face. I don't know if it did you. Here's the new Walgreens. Yay! Right there, folks. I'm pretty excited. I haven't been to Walgreens since we were in Vegas for so like a month. There it is. And now I have to figure out when the one opens. Um, 
over by my house. That's a pretty store. The building looks nice, it looks busy. Who I was hoping it wasn't gonna be because I wanted to uh, take you guys in with me. Well, I will anyway, but you know, sometimes it's a little awkward when there are a bunch of people in there. Looks like everyone else is excited to be at Walgreens. Who? Oh, this parking situation, I'm not liking because I have kind of slippery boots on. So, let's go back around. There's the new auto zone. We got a couple of those. There's one over by our house. Here comes the sun. Oh, I hear a little plane going overhead. Showgirls. Yeah. We do have a couple of strip clubs here. Because this is such a classy place. No, I don't care. It doesn't bother me if people strip. If that's what they want to do, do it. It doesn't impact my life one way or the other. Okay, I'm going to park here. And because I'm only using one hand, as I'm holding this camera, I have to back up and realign. I wanted to park closer so I didn't have to cross the parking lot because it's pretty icy. Okay. I'll see you in a bit. I guess they're still working on the exterior. I don't know if they let you record in Walgreens, but we'll give it a go. But that sign says 11 degrees. I don't know. Something like that. We'll see. I'll see you inside. Okay guys, well that was a fail. They aren't open yet. That's why all the vehicles are here. It's all the work people. So it said they're opening soon. Don't know when. So I've had two fails already this morning. But I know Walmart will be open and Joann's, so I'm going to head there. Bye! Okay guys, we're at Joann's. I just left. Probably one of the cheapest um, Joann's expeditions. So I found these. I think these are what uh, Lindsay, the frugal crafter, used for the... Um, pens that look like um, Wink of Luna. I believe these are them. So I'm going to try to put glitter in those and see what happens. And then I got geez, sorry, this glitter pack. I don't know if it's uh, ultra fine. It looked finer than the extra fine that they had. Um, so it has the silver and it has the gold, and then it has all these other colors. So those pinks are really pretty. Um, they did not have the plain water brushes. Well, they did, but it was like $8 for one. And I'm like, no, I don't think so. And then I got the pearl pen. I'd never had these before, but um, I know that a lot of people use them in their on their cards or their mixed media art journals so I thought I would get it um, perfect pearls every time and where's my receipt oh it's in my purse hang on I have to find it now okay so uh, the brush pens were $8.39 and I used a 60% off so it, hmm. So it took 503 off, and I paid 359. Then the pearl pen was 599, and the glitter was 479. So it came out to 1174. So not great prices, but you know you do what you can. And so now I'm going to head over to Michael's to see if I can find those empty water brushes. And, um, and then I'm going to go to Walmart. Okay, I'll see you later. Bye. Okay, I just left Michael's. And all they had for the water brushes were Tim Holtz 
One was $13 and one was $17 for one. And I'm like, yeah, no, thank you. So I got, I found another um, set of uh, water brush pens, eight pack. It's a recollections, $5.99. I had a 40% off coupon on my phone. So it brought it to $3.59. And that's what it looks like. So there's yellow, orange, red, purple, blue, green, brown, and black. The recollections. And so, and it's very sunny today. Very nice. Bentley Mall. This is where we came to vote. And that's where Michael's is. And then over behind me, Safeway's down there. And behind me is uh, Sally Beauty. And over there is Sam's Club. Things are pretty compact here. Okay, well, I'm going to go to Walmart. Wish me luck. Um, I do have some of the water pens at home, but I really wanted to save a set for water. But I may see what I can find online. Okay, bye. Hey, guys. So this is the end of my <clears throat> video. I got this Pledge Floor Care. I hope this is this is the right kind of stuff that um, Lindsay, the frugal crafter, was talking about <clears throat> to make the Wink of Stella pens. And then I saw these at Walmart, the Hampton Art Chalk Marker Set. And um, so I thought those would be cool. I have some of the chalk paper. So, opaque and water-based ink. And there are the directions. So I'm hoping that this is the right stuff. Um, I don't know. I was trying to figure out what the ingredients. But they don't make it easy. So, okay, guys. And it looks like I'm going to have to order the water brushes off of eBay. I actually have these two. And I think she said the green one was the best. So before I do that, I think I'll use the green one and try to make some using this and the glitter that I got. So, okay, well, that's the end of my day today on Friday, November 7th. Well, it's not the end of my day, but it's the end of my filming day. And I'll just talk to you guys later. Have a wonderful weekend. Bye.